Hi, I'm James, and in this video I'm taking a look at Dirt Rally running on Intel HD 5500 graphics. Uh, for this test we are running at 1366 by 768 and the low detail preset. There is a ultra low option, but just so that we're running the same settings I ran on HD 520, I opted to go with low. Um, as you can see here, um, the game is playable and sort of generally over about 30 frames per second. Uh, on HD 5500. Compared to HD 520 we are actually giving up quite a significant drop in frame rate. Um, I believe we are this test averaged 36 over a couple of runs um, whereas HD 520 averaged I believe 45 frames per second so it's actually about you know around 30% quicker. We are testing here on a i3 chip however versus an i7 for the HD 520 so that may be having some impact but it does seem like the newer graphics does give some reasonable improvements. Even so focusing on HD 5500 um, like I say low detail we have sort of playable frame rates if you're happy around 30 frames per second. You can also get some good improvements switching to ultra low detail. Um, like 520 though here you can see we did have um, when it's switched to the interior views at some point, some weird shader artifacts across the bonnet of the car. Um, this seemed to disappear if you just cycle through the cameras again, so it's not really game breaking, but just something you should probably be aware of. Anyway, I hope you found this video useful. Um, be sure to let us know in the comments what other games you'd like to see tested on HD 5500. Um, check out the other videos on our channel because we've tested a lot of other games on this and other platforms. And subscribe if you'd like to see more from us in the future. Thanks for watching.